here with my good friend Jody Arrington. Uh, we want everybody in Texas, West Texas, to know uh, that we're, at, we're in Eagle Pass today. It's unacceptable. Yes, it's an invasion. There are no consequences. We've heard that from all sorts of Border Patrol agents, that there are no consequences. This could end today if the President would decide that he has the political will to send people back where they came from. Instead, he's created a humanitarian crisis. I'm glad to be in the fight with my friend Jody. Uh, and we're going to go back to Washington and make sure that we actually take the steps to secure this border. Shameful, it's disgraceful for a country's great desires to cede operational control to terrorist drug cartels. That's what this president has done uh, by not enforcing the laws, by not providing for the common defense. And then what we have behind us is another consequence. It's called an epic humanitarian crisis, the likes of which we've never seen on U.S. soil. And so not only are the drug cartels killing Americans by pushing their poison into our communities, but they are abusing these folks and exploiting them because, as August said, there's no accountability for coming to this country in violations of our law of sovereignty and, and jeopardizing the safety of our citizens. So you know, we stand united to protect Texas, this country, and to reverse uh, this open border lawlessness.